Now, you know, when it comes to carp fishing, you can accidentally catch a carp while fishing for other species as well. And you can also target carp using a variety of fishing gear, the same gear they use for fishing for walleye, for bass, and so on. But if you're a dedicated carp fisherman, there's certain gear that you have to have. For example, if you look here behind me, you can see there are some long rods set up. They kind of look like steelhead rods. And they're all in these special rod holders that are called tripods. So the one that I've got here, you can see, can extend back and forth, so you can lengthen or shorten it, depending on the length of rod that you're using. The back is a standard rod holder, but at the front, where my rod is in, it's actually a strike indicator. So you'll see if I just touch the line, you can hear the alarm go off. So if a fish just touches my bait, I can hear it. So you can set the sensitivity and the audio, so it can be louder or softer. And if I want to use this also, I can clip the line onto here. You can see the snap that's right here and that'll take the line down so that I've got an additional maybe foot of line that a fish can take before he engages the drag. Now what I've done here, because I don't have a bait runner reel, I've actually let off on the drag. You can see how sensitive that is. I just touched the line, but I've let off on the drag. So if a good sized carp does pick up my bait, my alarm goes, it starts running, it's gonna be able to take line off. And as I pick the rod up and I put the rod forward, I'm actually gonna tighten the drag and set the hook. So some of the other fishermen that are here that fish for carp quite a bit have the bait runner feature where the fish can take drag, but as soon as they turn the handle, one rotation or two, that the normal drag engages. Now, I gotta show you what Roger has here, which is kind of neat. Now, Roger, you were telling me earlier that you have a remote alarm yeah. system. Yes, I do, yes. So you gotta explain it to us. I think it's really neat. So this is part of it? This is a receiver, and when it's switched on, yep. it it identifies with the with the alarm. Can I touch the line? Absolutely, I'm going to yeah. pretend I'm a fish. So I'm just going to give it a little tweak. Yeah. yeah, I'm just going to touch it. Now, why would you want a remote one like that? Well, I like it because if I'm stalking or spotting fish, looking for fish, yes. I can move oh quite a distance, probably a couple of hundred feet away or from more, your fishing away rod. from this. Then, if this if that goes, I can run back to the rod. 